welcome Health First Health Plans members. Thank you for taking an interest in staying active and improving your health. Today, we're going to highlight a few simple exercises you can do easily from your home. Just a reminder, make sure you talk with your doctor before starting any exercise programs. Before we start, you'll need a chair and an exercise band for these exercises. The first exercise is a chair squat. From a seated position, place your legs hip width apart and arms out to the side. Engage your core, quads, and glutes. With your head up, lean forward and press upward through your heels to a standing position. Notice how her feet stay shoulder width apart and her knees are in line with her feet. Next, we'll sit back down. In a controlled manner, lower yourself back into the chair by pushing or reaching back with our hips. Remember to keep your head up and core engaged. For assistance while performing this exercise, Include a chair with arms or handles for balance. For an added challenge, stand beside the chair. Our next exercise is the band row. Sit in a chair with your feet firmly planted on the ground and shoulder width apart. Hold the end of the exercise band in each hand. Lower the middle section of the band to the floor and step on the band with both feet. Sit up tall and engage the core. Begin with your arms straight and your hands located near the outside of the lower thighs. Pull the band backward towards the waist, tightening the muscles between the shoulder blades. Be sure to keep your wrists straight and in alignment with your forearm in a controlled manner. Next, let the band back out, lengthening your arms as your hands reach the final position near the thighs. Maintain a good and neutral posture throughout the exercise. A less challenging variation of the band row would be to use one foot instead of two. The last exercise is a chest press. With your band in hand, you'll start by sitting in a chair, keeping the core engaged. You'll need to loop the exercise band around your back. Hold the handles, one in each hand, so that you can feel initial resistance. If there's not enough resistance in the band, tie a knot in the band so that you can increase the total resistance. Next, exhale and press the bands forward until your arms are straight out in front of you at shoulder height. Then bend the elbows slowly and return your arms to the starting position. Do not lock your arms or elbows at full extension. Remember to maintain good posture throughout the exercise sitting up straight in your chair. When doing any of these exercises to keep your spine safe and stable, remember to engage your core by contracting and embracing the abdominal muscles, lats, erector spinae muscles, hip flexors, and glutes. Thank you for joining us and have a great workout.